Kanye West beefs with Peppa Pig and fans are confused, what did Peppa do? It all started with a Pitchfork review and led to an Instagram post that left millions of Kanye West fans confused. Inside Yee's beef with Peppa Pig. And to think it all started with a Pitchfork review. After British animated Piglet, musician extraordinaire Peppa Pig's debut album edged out Kanye West's astronomically hyped epic Donda as their preferred album, 6.5 to 6.0, fans gleefully mimed the decision. In the reviews, written by Peyton Thomas and Dylan Green, respectively, Pitchfork called Peppa's album charming, while noting Kanye's album was barely finished and came with a lot of baggage. After the initial reviews went viral on Twitter, Peppa herself made a hilariously snarky comment on September 1, writing Peppa didn't need to host listening parties in Mercedes-Benz Stadium to get that point five. The clever diss invoked the increasingly lavish listening parties Kanye threw for the album over the summer while he spent a fortune to live in the stadium. At one of the parties, Kim Kardashian famously took the stage in a now iconic Balenciaga wedding dress when it looked like perhaps the duo might still rekindle. However, on Saturday the beef escalated to a new level after Kanye himself brought Peppa's name into the growing list of celebrities he's gone on tirades against on Instagram. In Peppa's esteemed company? Take a deep breath. Taylor Swift, Kid Cudi, Billie Eilish, Drake, Corey Gamble, his cousin, Black History Month, and of course, P. Davidson. According to Kanye himself, that abridged list should be twice as long. In a Saturday Instagram post, Kanye shared a screenshot of a tweet listing Kanye beefs from the Twitter account at Hip Hop Numbers. After alleging there were many names missing from the list, which already included Peppa, Kanye went on to list just a few of his biggest feuds who may be missing, Universal Studios, the cast of Saturday Night Live, Jeff Bezos, and Barack Obama included. He concluded his statement by noting, being rich is fun. These days a Kanye rant isn't complete without some Pete Davidson hate, and ye made sure to leave yet another message for Skeet. Kanye previously shared screenshots of what appeared to be Kim pleading with him to stop creating a breeding ground for attacks against Pete, after the rapper urged fans to scream Kim and Kanye forever if they saw the comedian. Kanye went on to list just a few of his biggest feuds who may be missing, Universal Studios, the cast of Saturday Night Live, Jeff Bezos, and Barack Obama included. He concluded his statement by noting, being rich is fun. These days a Kanye rant isn't complete.